Hey YouTube, how's it going? Today I'm back with another video and we're going to be talking about the Sony SRS XB Bluetooth speakers and how we can do the pairing between each of them to create a 10 speaker party chain. All right, everybody, so now I'm going to show you how to pair these together. You must do this in the following sequence or you will go nuts and pull your hair out of your head. First thing is one speaker at a time, you're going to power it on. Now this is assuming that you've already registered these through your Sony Music app. Um, and even if you haven't done that, that's okay. All you have to do to just run these is power them on. And then once you hear the beep, you're going to hold the plus and the add button together. I know these are upside down, but you're going to push the plus and the add button together for about two seconds till you hear a beep and then these lights will flash. You'll get these ones going. All right, so this one's in pairing mode to go to the next one. Now we're gonna to go to the next one. We're gonna power it on. Wait for the beep. We're now gonna hold these two buttons again, two seconds. Now, if you look back here at this other one, you've got solid lights, solid lights, then one will flash, then the other will flash here. These two are now pretty much paired together. Let's go to the third one. Powered up. And let's hold these down. And if we did everything correct, according to Sony, which we've done this before, we should now all be paired together and we should get some sound. So here we go. Now remember that you can only control the volume of the main unit with your iPad or your smartphone. After that you have to turn the other ones up or down manually by their buttons. So here we go. It's going to be a little loud when we first start. And this is my YouTube video so we don't get copyright infringements, blah blah blah. Now I turned it all the way down and hit mute so it did that. Keep him low, we'll bring this guy up. Now bring this guy up. This will go a lot louder. Now this one's coming up. That's how you pair them together. Kind of gives you a little bit of sound on them. I put those kind of up by the mic so you could tell it was exactly which one that was working. But the bad thing is, is when you turn the volume up or down, uh, there's no way to control the volume on each independent speaker. Uh, only if you do them manually here. Now, like I said, if you have this, the, the app going inside and you run some stuff to the app, um, you can connect your, you can group with the other speakers and every time we try and hear it, it's just a nightmare. And like we're trying to group them now and hear all of our speakers are registered, but I don't know if it's the app or me or what, but it seems to be a little bit of a problem. Anyways, be sure to hit the like button for this video. Subscribe to my channel. I'm Wes, Derek's behind the camera. See you next time.